Assalamu alaikum. I hope all of you are doing fine and a very warm welcome to the new academic session. This is our first lesson and in this lesson we are going to discuss broken hundred squares that is on learner book page number four. You can see some sections that have been made on that page. Now these sections are taken from the hundred square chart. Using this 100 square chart, we will learn what patterns are being made when we move in a row and what pattern of number is being made if we move in a column. The numbers are written in an increasing order that is from the smallest to the largest in a row. Similarly, in a column, the numbers are increasing that is from the smallest to the largest one. The one being the smallest at the top of the column and 91 being the largest number in this column but here we will observe that the number or the digit present in the unit place are same that is we were talking about the first column number one is written and all the digits present on the unit number are same that is one whereas the numbers present at the tens place are written in an increasing order that is from smallest 1 then 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 now let's take another example for example I choose a number in the center of the 100 square chart that is 34 now I will see that the numbers present below the 34 have 4 digit in its unit place whereas the numbers on the 10th place are increasing that is after 3 we get 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 whereas in a row the number on the 10th place remains the same as you can see this this row is of teens numbered the number are same one is same in each number whereas the numbers at the unit place are increasing that is 1 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and this is 20 now. Now we are going to fill these uh, broken sections from the 100 square chart and we will take the help of the 100 square chart. Now first of all I have this number 42. I am going to identify 42 in the 100 square chart. Now 42 is here. I am going to fill the column below. You can see that below it is 52, then it is 62, then it is 72. And now if I have to move in this direction, that is from left to right, so I have to look for the numbers on this side. This is 43, 44 and 45. Now again, I am going to identify, I have 43 here and again we have 3 in the units place. I am going to write 3 here and the numbers will increase 4 and then I will have 5, then 6 and this is 7. Now again, I have 44 here and its line is here. I am going to write 4 in the units place. And again in the increasing manner I'm going to write 5, 6 and 7. 45 is here and below are these numbers. This will be 55, 65 and this is 75. Now let's have a look at this. This is 4. I'm going to identify 4 in my 100 square chart. This is 4. Now I have to write all the numbers below it. I have 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 blocks here. So 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. That means 14, 24, 34, 44 and 54. Now I have to fill the fifth column. This is 15, this is 25, this is 35, 
45 and 55. Now number 36. I'm going to circle 36 on my 100 square chart and then I'm going to fill 1, 2 and 3. This is 37, 38, 39. Now I'm going to fill the column now. This is 46, 56, 66 and 76. Now this is I'm going to write here. You have to keep in mind that the unit numbers or unit digits in these numbers are same whereas the tenth number are increasing. Now I'm going to identify this shape in the 100 square chart. First of all I have to find 47. Now I have 1, 2, 3. Okay, 1, 2, 3 blocks and then one block up this block and then I have one block below so first of all I'm gonna write 57 here then this is 48 49 50 and as I move up the number decreases so this will be 40 now let's have a look at this 33 missing number and then 35 so simply I will write 34 here now let's have a look here 34 33 35 and well and these two numbers here. I'm going to write 24 and 44 to solve this shape we are going to identify 75 in the hundred square chart this is 75 now if we are moving in a row this is simply like this 76 77 78 now 75 now that means uh, in this column the unit numbers will remain the same L look here it is 85 95 the unit numbers are same and 85 and this is 95 similarly 76 86 and 96 now this is 78 below it it is 88 because it is increasing but as I move up the number will decrease so that means this will be 68 now let's find 37 this is 37 at the top this number is indicating that this is the seventh column and the unit number will be 7 okay I wrote it and now as I'm moving down the number will increase this is 4 and this is 5 so 37 47 and 57 now this row is easy to solve the number next to 47 is 48 and the number before 47 is 46 now it is important to remember that when we move in a row the numbers are simply increasing at the unit place or we can say that we are writing the line of 70s whereas in a column the tens number are increasing in an order or decreasing if I move up and the unit numbers remain the same I hope you understand this video and use 100 square chart for solving the given worksheet take care and Allah Hafiz